Hi, Linda Davis of Inner Harbor Acupuncture. It's early May 2020, and over the past few months, there have been great changes. Changes unanticipated. Changes certainly unrequested by most of us. This is worldwide in connection with the pandemic of COVID-19 coronavirus. Big physical impact, some greater than others, but I think most people have experienced changes on the physical level, whether that be sequestration, social distancing, illness, uh, stopping work, any level has not been touched. We also have uh, impact on emotional level. Traditional Chinese medicine, TCM, has long recognized the value and the place of balanced emotional expression. Now when I say balanced emotional expression, I don't mean mild. I mean emotional expression that is appropriate to the situation. It is a seeming response. These days, you anger, we anger, because this seems not right. All these changes, it's too much. We grieve, we grieve for that which has passed. We grieve for that who has passed. We sorrow because we have loved deeply. We sorrow because the old ways seem like they're gone. We fear because the future is uncertain. We cannot see into the future the way we used to. Our expectations are totally turned on their heads. So to help build emotional resiliency, so the ability to kind of withstand all these different emotional feeling states, I'm going to show you some acupressure points. If you are new to acupressure and working with Qi, I'm going to give you a little hints, uh, but I'm going to suggest first when you start to do this and you start to practice, and this is something that I suggest that you do on an ongoing basis. It's not a one-time fixes everything. You want to train and build up these uh, energetic connections in your body-mind system. Set yourself up to work and practice in a place and time with minimal or no distractions. Uh, see about working or practicing when you're not in an extreme emotional state. Yes, building emotional resist resilience, not resistance, resilience. I'm going to have some point location reference sheets available. I'm going to set each of the different emotions according to TCM, traditional Chinese medicine guidelines, so that you can pick and choose. Uh, do as many as you like, use them as you see fit. Uh, a little bit about acupressure and working with your hands. So when you go to connect with the acupuncture point, it's not about how hard. It's not about massage, per se. It's about finding that place on the body that you make an energetic connection. And it may feel like the right place. And you may not be able to describe it more than that. It may give you uh, a, a sense that, yeah, this is the point. So actually go a little gently and play around. Practice working with your hands, feeling the different points. Practice the point locations. Do the work.